One of the first questions that we always tend to get is, is what's the right oil for, for my engine, okay? So first and foremost, right? So you being an AMP, it's all about service bullets and service information, right? The OEM, you don't wanna go against whatever the OEM is gonna recommend. And so if you look at it, all the OEM recommendations are brand agnostic. So they don't really call out if it's an Aeroshell product or a Phillips 66 product. What they do call out is a specification. So J1899, for example, and J1966, those are the two specifications that all these engine oils are governed under. And what that means is J1899 contains an ashes dispersant, J1966 does not contain an ashes dispersant. That's the two distinctions. From there, then we look at different viscosities. So you, a lot of straight grade viscosities that are out there, right? That's the older technology. So the newer technology, I say newer, it's really 1976 because Phillips was the first product that actually came to the market that was a multi-viscosity product and that's actually the Aviation Anti-Rust. It was 1976 that was developed actually for Beechcraft. Then in 1979 it was XC. XC uh, 2019 was, was the 40 uh, year anniversary. So that then came along and that product is ashless dispersant containing. So you can use it in multiple temperature ranges, right? Because a lot of folks think, well, I'm running a 100 in the summer. I need a multi-vis maybe in the winter. Yeah, I bet you hear that quite a bit. I do, yeah. So one of the things that we wanted to do was actually put some data behind, hey, is there any benefit of looking at straight grade in hotter environments compared to a multi-vis? So that's actually what this is here. I'm running that straight grade in the winter. I'm in Florida or I'm in Georgia, somewhere really hot.